No consequences for my actions. I can have love too, even though I'm a jailbird. Hey guys, Mac and Teasley here. Today we're gonna be playing more Bit Life. Now, last time we played Bit Life, I tried to become the happiest person in the world, and well, it wasn't very successful. So this time, I thought let's do the exact opposite and become a horrible person and do horrible things. What could possibly go wrong? It'll probably be fine. Let's do it. All right, we are Carla Simpson. I was born a female in Boston, United States. I was conceived after my mother's birth control failed. My birthday is February 3rd. I'm an Aquarius. My name is Carla Simpson. My father is Tara Simpson, a makeup artist, age 39. My mother is Aaliyah Simpson, a real estate agent, age 30. I have an older brother named Elvaro. We will age up. You are suffering from the chicken pox. We'll go to the doctor because that's a normal thing. Let's see James Love. You are no longer suffering from the chicken pox. Woohoo! Age up, age up. The boy next door asks if you want to go see the hot new kids movie with him. Aww. What will you do? Ah, uh, meh, that sounds boring. Nah, I'm good. You broke your parents' grill while you were playing. What will you do? I mean, I broke it or it wasn't me. It wasn't me, man, it wasn't me. We'll age up. A bully at school has been making up untrue rumors about you. What will you do? Assault her. You assaulted the bully. You popped her ear, you lacerated her shin, and you socked her eyelid. Okay, all right. That's pretty rough, man. We got into, we got into a scuffle. You are feeling bisexual tendencies. What are you? I'm bisexual then. We'll age up. It's time to take your driving test. Yeah, let's take the test. What does this road sign mean? Route marker, height limit, speed limit. Route marker? Yeah, we done, we passed it. That's what's up. Age up, you graduated from high school. We can pick computer, computer science, biology, information systems, English, or history for college. I wanna say, let's do biology. Because why not? Just because we're Yeah? Your application to university was rejected. Well, it's fine. We are not going very many places in life, so we'll just age up. But maybe we should get a job. A waste collector? Apply? Yay, perfect fit. That's what's up, man, that's what's up. You have been offered cocaine, what will you do? Well, we are picking all the wrong answers. So, we'll do it. Oh God, hopefully it doesn't come back to bite us. We'll try it again. You've been fired from your position as a waste collector for the city of Boston because I failed a drug test. Insult my supervisor. How dare he? You called your supervisor a tool bag on your way out. <laughs> I love it. All right, uh, let's get another job. It's probably fine. Maybe we can get a job as a senior waste collector. Eh, we have experience already. Denied. You know what? Auto mechanic? Apply? You didn't get the interview. Mortician? Apply? Oh my goodness. It's almost like they know. Server? Yes, we're a server now. Okay, it's fine. We're, we're good. We're back on track. We're pretty young, so I think we can bounce back from this. All right, someone called you a twat. What will you do? Assault her? Forgive her? Insult her back. Assault her. <laughs> You attacked her, but she dodged you. Next time I'll get her. Age up, age up. You saw someone call your father a bastard. Ooh, that's a bad word. What will you do? Assault him, duh. There's more where that came from. You assaulted him, you shattered his jugular, you impaled his neck, you poked his throat, and you trampled his mouth. Um, I mean, that's a lot of like facial stuff going on there. I'm sorry. You've been charged with assault and are facing one year in prison. Which local law firm will you hire to defend you in court? Um, well, we have some money, so we could do the old associates. You have been found not guilty of assault. Yes, that's what's up. Innocent baby. While out getting a coffee, you encounter a monk, disrespecting you. What do you do? We assault him! You assaulted a monk who was disrespecting you. 
You flattened his neck. You shattered his Adam's apple. You pierced his face. You bruised his cheek. And he died from his injuries. Can we get away with it? You've been busted. You've been charged with manslaughter and are facing seven years in prison. Which law firm will you hire to defend you? Well, now we can't afford the more expensive law firm. So, Bailey and Associates, please? You've been convicted of manslaughter and are sentenced to seven years in prison. I've been fired at the cafe. I keep getting fired. I mean, I'm still an okay, like, decent person, probably. What can we do in prison? Ooh, start a riot. I like it. Let's see what happens. You started a prison riot. You have been beaten by a gang of prisoners. They impaled your brain. They whacked your torso. Your prison sentence has been extended by two years for inciting a riot. Well, you know what? It's fine. It's whatever. We didn't care. We'll age up. You've been diagnosed with depression. Can I appeal my sentence? Maybe? Do we have money? Bailey and Associates? Ooh, McDonald's and Associates. Steel and Associates. Well, Steel got us out last time from that one thing. We do have money, so let's try it. Why not? You lost the appeal! Guilty as charged. Come on, Steel. What the heck? I thought you had a good reputation for getting guilty people off. It's fine. Let's see what else we can do. Ooh, we can attempt to escape. This might not go well for us, but we'll try it. You failed to escape from prison. It's fine. We'll age up. Your father passed away at the age of 71. He died from the measles. You can't attend the funeral because you're in prison. No consequences from my actions. <laughs> oh, it's fine. I love you, dad. You know that. You know that. Age up. You have been offered GHB in prison. What will you do? I don't even know what that is but we're choosing all the wrong answers so we're gonna take it give it to me good job don't die please oh my mother retired nice good job mom i'm proud of you my health is not doing very well and there's really nothing i can do in prison you've been released from prison yes asking you shall receive you're suffering from laryngitis we have to do some fixing up here. We are not in good health. I need to live long enough so I can be a bad person. So let's fix ourselves up a little bit by going to the doctor and we'll see Dr. James. He was a good guy and we'll treat that. Let's treat the depression as well. Let's go to school or something. We're not very smart. We need to get a little smarter so we can study a little bit. It was a one-time thing. All right, we'll age up. A shady politician named Dash asks you if you'd like to return to his office for a debriefing. What will you do? You had a one-night stand. And I liked it. All right. Our health is kind of low. Let's uh, see if we can get that up a little bit by going to the gym. Oh, God. Go to the library? People do that. Now we can continue being a bad person. You've been offered ecstasy. What will you do? Da -da 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 -da. If I could whistle, I would. You have achieved enlightenment through your experience with ecstasy. We're doing really horrible things, Carla. I'm sorry. Wait, and we're unemployed? Let's try to get a job. I don't know what we can get seeing as we have prison and drug addiction on our record. So let's try Apprentice Moonshiner. That sounds cool. We might be able to get that. Yeah, we're Moonshiners. Cool. I like it. All right, let's age up. Some of your friends are going to a local nightclub called Casey's Lounge. I feel like loving. Let's do it. The bouncer won't let you into the club. Because of my looks? <gasps> can I punch the bouncer? Like, what the heck, man? That was rude. Maybe we can get some plastic surgery so that we can punch people. Let's get a Brazilian butt lift. We'll go to Heather. Get the surgery. It was successful, but the results were like kind of okay. Kind of. You've been offered Ritalin. What will you do? It's fine. Age 43. You've been offered gin. 
Yo, Loki IRL, I like gin, so we will order some gin. We'll do that. Age up. Your mother passed away at the age of 75. She died of diabetes. Inheritance. Whoa, we can do a lot with this. Attend her funeral, mommy dearest, I love you. While out getting coffee, you encounter a businessman looking smug. What will you do? Assault him. Because why not? You have been charged with assault and are facing two years in prison. Which local law firm will you hire to defend you in court? Feel got us off the hook that one time. Even though they couldn't appeal my jail sentence, I think we could try to go with them and see what happens. So... Busted! You know what? That's fine. And we were fired from our job. We're in prison. I won't try to escape or do anything crazy. It's only two years. We'll just age up and we'll take that and we'll age up. All right, let's go. You have been diagnosed with bunions. Yeah. Let's go with Serena. No, look, are bunions forever? Ew, that's gross. Ooh, your friends are on social media. Will you join too? Nah, we'll stay away from social media. We have too much of a record going on that I don't need anybody knowing what's going on about my life, so no thank you. Ooh, a woman named Imani tells you she used to be a softball pitcher and misses being on the mound. What will you do? Uh, get at it? Oh, yeah. All right, we liked it. Cool. While waiting at the bus stop, you witness a punk rocker graffitiing a wall. What will you do? Try to intervene, call the police, look the other way. Try to intervene. The punk rocker assaulted you. He spanked your rectum. Fight back, run away from him, call the police. We're fighting back, baby. Let's do this. You assaulted him. You whipped his Adam's apple. You elbowed his nipple. Oh my goodness, this game is too crazy. You've been charged with assault and are facing three years in prison. Feel and associates got us off that one time, but mainly maybe Bailey's the way to go. I don't know. Let's just go with Thiel. Let's go with Thiel. <gasps> Not guilty of assault. We got off again. That's awesome. Our health, happiness, and looks are not doing very good. So <laughs> let's improve that. A few moments later. Ooh. A fellow named James Anderson starts sending you naked pics of him. What will you do? Why does nobody want to marry me? Everyone has been a hookup. I can have love too, even though I'm a jailbird. Uh, fine, we'll hook up with him. All right, age up. Someone called you a twat. Again? Insult her back, forgive her, assault her. Assault her. You assaulted her. Yikes, she assaulted you. Oh no! There's a... Busted! Hey, listen, she assaulted me back. And she was rude. Let's go with Theo. Let's see if we can get off. Busted! Theo, my guys, what's going on? Age up, age up. Yay, we're out of prison. Not so bad. When you can age up, like, immediately, prison's like, whatever. It's like, this is not a big deal. IRL now, that's a big deal. All right, my health is still at 10%, so... Let's see if we can meditate a little bit. And I'm not liking the meditation. I feel like that's not really doing anything for me. We can also go to the library so we can become smarter. And then we'll go to the gym as well so we can maybe become a little bit healthier. I don't know. Those seems like healthy things to do. I'm not really sure here. We're gonna age up. Ooh, an acquaintance has offered you $3,100 to take a suitcase to Mexico. What will you do? What could go wrong? What? You've been charged with drug trafficking and are facing 20 years in prison. Which law firm will you use? We can't afford Thiel. Even though they probably might not even be able to get us out anyways. Okay, let's go with Bailey because... Why not? Let's try it. You have been convicted of drug trafficking and sentenced to 20 years in prison. All right, prison, let's do some stuff. Let's attempt to escape. You failed to escape from prison. Let's attempt to escape again. You were caught trying to escape from prison. Eight years for felony escape has been added. Ah, uh, I've been diagnosed with depression. We'll age up a little bit. Oh no, we died! At the age of 69. I was thinking that we would age up and then try to maybe appeal the sentence because we're older and things are okay. That didn't actually happen. 
Carla, I'm sorry you died in prison because you were a horrible person. Our happiness and our karma were at an all-time low. Absolute zero. Carla Simpson passed away in prison at the age of 69. Her big brother, Alvaro, and her nephew, Tommy Lee, couldn't be bothered to attend her funeral. An undisciplined young lady, Carla squandered much of her time here in prison. Friends say she struggled with severe anger management issues. I mean, they're not wrong. We learned a lot of lessons here. We learned, do not fight people. Do not try to escape prison. Don't traffic drugs to Mexico. Carla, thank you for these life lessons. And thank you for hanging out with me while I play another rendition of Bit Life. This one got really, really crazy. If you want me to try another challenge, let me know in the comments down below. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe so that I know you're enjoying my content. You can also follow me on Twitch, Twitter, and Instagram at Mac and Cheese, please. I'll put those links in the description down below. And don't forget to click any of these videos right here if you're interested in more content. I put out new videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Until next time, bye guys.